Brandon Woodruff on the mound tonight for the crew. Nine and two looking for his 10th win of the season. He has been the steady arm in the Brewers rotation over the last couple of months and the crew hoping they can get some length out of him tonight against this very good Pirates lineup. And so Kevin Newman will lead things off. Swinging a looping line drive over second into right center field a base hit a 19 game hitting streak for Kevin Newman the most since 1899 for a Pirates rookie. Yeah, We're talking century Mark. I mean it's just amazing what he, we're watching him do one away and they got to deal with Josh Bell 307 with 22 homers leads baseball with 70 driven in. Bell hits one off the end of the bat to short Saladino's got it flips to hero one on the first not in time. Just a cue shot from Josh Bell. Runners will be on the corners for Colin Moran. Here's a swing and a liner out to right and pass Yelich to the wall. Moran's going to drive in at least one. Bell touches third. He's being waved home. Here's Hira's relay from short right. It's in plenty of time and Bell is out. Good relay in. Yelich to Hira to the plate. Bell was out by a good bit, but a run in on Moran's two base hit with two outs. And the Pirates will take a 1 0 lead going to the bottom of the first. Jordan Lyles, that fastball plays big. It really does. He's coming off a hamstring injury. Ironically, his previous two starts before going on the IL were against these Milwaukee Brewers. Brewers runners, though, wind up at second and third, and the batter is going to be Ryan Braun. Swinging a ground ball to third. Moran will come home and throws offline, but still in plenty of time to get Grandal for the out. Diaz with the tag and Yelich stays at second so a fielder's choice two outs and now with two down the batter is going to be Eric Thames Braun the big lead the throw goes down the right field line Yelich will score Braun stops at second and the Brewers have tied the game on a bad throw by Lyles to first base you know I, I'm not really sure why you would do that unless you think Braun is going to steal a base you, know, you go after the hitter. Gift. One pitch away from getting in the dugout with a one nothing lead. Gift of a run from the Pirates defense. And the pitch. Thames rockets one to right in the corner. Ryan Braun's going to score. Eric Thames is in the second. He's turning second. He's going to third. The throw and he's in there. I go back to that that inning though is set up or that even that at bat that hit is because of the missed pickoff over at first base. Brandon Woodruff back out there. He's pitched well so far worked out of a little bit of trouble in the first inning and a check swing strike three anyway and it's a strikeout for Woodruff for the first out of the inning and that's a call third strike on Newman and it's back to back strikeouts for Woodruff here in the third. Here's strike three to Reynolds and Brandon Woodruff strikes out the side here in the top of the third. Milwaukee comes to bat top of the order Grandal Yelich and then Moustakis against Jordan Lyles. First pitch swinging Yasmani Grandal. One away Frazier takes care of it. So we're going to come back or pass the mound under the shortstop Newman who gloves it on to first and the inning is through three ground outs on six pitches and there's two quick outs for Woodruff here in the fourth as Colin Moran comes to the plate swing and a miss he strikes out Moran and Woodruff has sat down nine in a row one down and here's Eric Thames Thames with that RBI triple back in the first inning that's the big hit in this contest so far Lyles 3 2 pitch turned on hit deep right field if it's fair it's gone it is a fair ball. Eric Thames goes deep and the Brewers extend their lead to three to one Thames with number 11 and that gets the folks here at Miller Park to their feet Thames turned on that pitch and just tucked it inside the pole down the right field line and so now uh, Grandal in scoring position for Yelich who is hitless in the series he's sitting on 999 career hits swing and a miss struck him out Yelich strikes out one out. Swing and a miss struck him out on a curve. So after the leadoff double strikeout foul out strikeout. So one out and Grandal who has bunted his way on for a single and let off the fifth inning with a double and a swing and a fly ball out to center toward right center long run for Marte slides and makes a catch hip high he had to go a long way to make the catch and that's the 
second out. Very good play. Yeah, that was a great play to come in and get that out. He had to read it correctly off the bat. Two are up, two are down, and the top of the order coming up now in Kevin Newman. 2-2, two -two, soft liner, fair ball. It's trickling toward left. Newman around first. He's digging in for two, and he has a double here with two outs in the eighth inning. This might be it for Woodruff tonight. Another outstanding job by Woody, and uh, he will leave the game and a standing O for Brandon Woodruff. A chance to win his 10th of the year. Hater again, just dominating hitters. He'll get a pinch hitter, Jose Osuna, who's three for nine as a pinch hitter this year, and all three of those hits homers. Swinging and a pop-up. This one is playable. Eric Thames calling everybody off and makes the grab, and this one is over. Didn't want to let that one get away again. Brewers win game two. Final Brewers three. Pirates one.